Namaste. Today, I am going to be talking about certain simple tips that you should be following so that the sugars could be kept in normal range. As you know, it is the severity and duration of diabetes that leads to all the complications. The high blood sugar levels traveling through the blood vessels reaching all the organs like your kidneys or your eyes, your heart causes a lot of blockages and other issues which lead to all the uh, complications uh, be it uh, nephropathy, neuropathy or cardiac complications and so on. So if you keep the sugar levels normal, all these complications could be kept at bay. So let's see what are the simple ways to keep your sugars in normal range. As I always say, it is diet, exercise and regular medications. Lifestyle modifications is the most important thing that treats and prevents the development of many, many diseases. So keeping your weight in ideal range is very important. And this could be achieved by uh, regular exercise as well as following a healthy, nutritious diet. So when I talk about exercise in diabetes, regular exercise of one hour every day is extremely important. So it could be 10 minutes of warm up followed by 30 minutes of brisk exercise followed by 10 minutes of cool down. So running or jogging or swimming, all these things constitute the aerobic exercises. Along with aerobic exercises, you need flexibility, which is achieved by all the stretching and yoga. And strength training also forms a very important part of exercise, wherein working with weights, simple dumbbell exercises would be of use. Apart from that, Shatapavali needs to be practiced. As in, whenever you eat your food, after that you need to Walk for at least 10 minutes before you sit down. Be it breakfast, lunch or dinner, please do that walking around of 10 minutes before sitting back in your couch. So this definitely does help you in the digestion as well as keeping your sugars in control. Even anti-gravity exercises as in walking upstairs after your food also does help. Now talking about diet, there is nothing specific called a diabetic diet. Actually, it is very, very simple diet, which is healthy, nutritious and everybody can follow. So when I talk about diabetic diet, there are certain things that you need to restrict and avoid totally. That would be your sugar, jaggery, honey and maida or all the bakery products because these things does spike your sugar levels up. Everything in moderation should be the dictum. So stick to one cereal plan in a meal. Uh, if you think of rice for breakfast, afternoon could be millets or wheat and night would be vice versa. Five small meals a day should be practiced. So breakfast, lunch, dinner, all of us are used to be having that. So breakfast at 9 o'clock, lunch at 2 o'clock and dinner by uh, 8 p.m. And this is what all of us practice. The gap here is pretty high. So introduce some small meal in between breakfast and lunch and lunch and dinner so that you do not hog at one time. So between breakfast and lunch at around 11.30, you could have a fruit. And between lunch and dinner, you could have some khakra, murmura or some salads or some sprouts as a evening snack. So this way you are not super hungry by dinner and you can restrict the amount of carbohydrates that you take. Otherwise also in a typical Indian system what we see is uh, the katori of dal and sabzis are very small and the carbohydrate portion be it rotis or uh, bakris or rice it is usually high. So this carbohydrate load is what increases your postprandial sugar. So in order to avoid that, reduce the amount of carbohydrates in diet. So reduce the number of rotis that you take. Substitute with salads, sabzis, dal. So this will definitely keep your sugars in 
normal range. And if you are working, definitely an apple or pear at around 11.30 and 5 o'clock along with your coffee tea, you could definitely have a khakra or so. So that when you come back home, you are not craving for that food. So practice this five small meals a day. And these days, COVID enforced uh, lockdowns actually has seen a lot of uh, work from home. And therein people have been trying a lot of uh, new recipes and people are sitting at home at one place without exercising. This has definitely spiked sugars of a lot of people. So whenever you are on a call, please make sure that you walk around and take your call. This is a very simple thing which will keep your sugars in normal range. And uh, even if you are working out of office, make sure that you get up every one hour. Take a walk for two minutes at least and sit down. So this way, even your varicose veins do not develop. These days, prolonged sitting has been attributed as a new risk factor for cardiovascular diseases. It is said that sitting is the new smoking uh, because it increases the visceral fat or the fat around your liver, pancreas leading to insulin resistance, leading to diabetes and all these cardiovascular issues. Along with cardiovascular risk, it is increasing the incidence of lot of hiatus hernia as in reflex esophagitis, lot of constipation and many other issues along with metabolic syndromes and increased sugar levels and so on. So make sure that you walk around whenever you get a chance. And third most important thing is medications. Consult your doctor regularly. Keep monitoring your sugar levels. At least once a month, make sure that you do your fasting PP test and once in three months, at least your HbA1c test, which is the average sugar of the last three months. And studies have proved that with every increase in HbA1c, your cardiovascular risk is increasing by 25%. So make sure that your HbA1c is in target level. Now, when you keep monitoring your sugar levels and if you see that it is increasing, get back to your doctor and get it set. It is in our habit that if we see that things are deranged, we definitely do things to correct it. So when you regularly check your sugars and see that it is deranged, you will definitely do that extra exercise diet. And if it is not controlled, Please make sure that you get back to your doctor, readjust the doses and get it corrected. Taking medications, uh, tablets, insulin, all these things are extremely important if you are already a diabetic to keep your sugars in normal range and the complications away. So be aware, exercise regularly, be stress free, sleep well and take your medications regularly and keep your sugars in normal range. Take care and bye.